Hey, you guys, it's me, Miss Prosperous with Prosperous Creations. I wanted to come on really quick, do a really quick um, video on how do I prevent my shirts from being scorched. You know, when you bleach them and then you press them, um, just making sure that it, it doesn't look burned and, um, the, you know, the brown marks. So here we go. Here's one of my um, shirts that I'm about to do. And I'm going to show you guys my trick. <sighs> something that everyone has in their house, at least I think. Here's my print, Sweet Magnolias. And this is an actual order, so I'm gonna, that's why I'm gonna go ahead and do this one. Cause it's an order anyway, so why not just go ahead and get my order out of the way too? Okay, give me one second. I have my parchment paper. Y'all know I use parchment paper, butcher paper. I mean, I just, I use all different type of paper. So don't mind me if you say she uses the, yeah, every time it's probably something different. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and press it. I normally press it at 385 for 60 seconds. Um, and then I'm gonna show you what prevents it from, prevents your bleach tees from having those brown spots or looking like they're, burned of course i do have a whole process when it comes to my um bleach tees tie-dye tees which i do a class in person so that's not something that i just you know throw out um on youtube so there's a whole process that i do when it comes to my bleach tees and tie-dye however i get a lot of um questions um when it comes to the why do the shirts look burned um or scorched or whatever after you bleach it, wash it, press it. So I've already bleached my shirts, washed them. So this is my pressing part. So I'm gonna go ahead and... So if you can see, it looks dark, like a brownish color. Peroxide, you guys. I spray it with peroxide. And you can spray it down. It don't even matter. I spray it with peroxide and I let it sit. I let it sit. So that little like brownish color is going to actually end up turning. Now, I personally will probably let it sit under here for about two to three minutes. And then I sit it outside and let it air dry. But once um, it dries, that brownish look is even leaving even now but the brownish just so you can see see how it looks kind of brown that's because that heat but it's clearing up even now so when it dries it's going to look like this white so that is the trick you guys peroxide straight peroxide and i get my bottle you can get it from uh, winn dixie walgreens wherever um, but that's the trick, you guys, to keep your shirts looking bleached to white. All right, you guys. Well, thank you for tuning in. Um, until next time, you guys have a blessed and prosperous day.